everyone, it's Steve from b and Photo and I'm here with Steve Bannerman from Assimilate. He's the VP of Marketing and we're going to talk about Scratch and Scratch Lab. Steve, some new announcements about Scratch for NAB. What are they? You know, we're actually pretty excited. This is probably one of the most significant versions of the product that we've ever announced. Um, there's really kind of four takeaways from NAB. The first is that we have um, just recently acquired a license from Apple to officially encode ProRes files on the Windows versions of our product. So that's Windows, but that's not, I mean, that's done before, but this is the first time it's a non-server version. So yeah, and, you know, typically if you wanted to encode ProRes on Windows, you had a couple of choices. Um, you either had to buy into a high-end solution that was typically tied to hardware, so it was a turnkey, or it was based on Windows Server, or you had to use a reverse engineered solution that was not approved by Apple and take your chances with that. So this is the first time that a software only product based on Windows 7 or Windows 8 has had an actual license from Apple to encode ProRes on Windows. So we're pretty excited about it. Yeah, that's stunning. That's sort of, I read that and I was like, wow. Yeah. yeah so yeah. that's cool. And, yeah. and I don't know, what are you going to follow that one up with? <laughs> well, well, some of the other things that are pretty interesting, you know, all of this is about saving people money, saving people time. So um, we've been working with the folks at RED to be able to debayer footage from RED cameras, the Epic cameras and, uh, and below, in real time, full res, without a RED rocket card, using only GPUs. So it works really, really well, for instance, in the new Mac Pro with the dual AMD GPUs. It works really, really well in PCs with um, dual um, NVIDIA K6000 GPUs. So you don't need the red, the red Rocket card in order to be able to do that. So that's a really big cost savings there. It is, yeah, and, and so Red has enabled um, um, partners like us to be able to uh, to write our software to, to handle that. So we're pretty excited about that from Red. Congratulations on that. That's yeah, great. Yeah, thank you very much. And then there were a couple of other things you wanted to tell us about. Yeah, there's a there's some really great news for folks that wanted to be able to use um, Scratch and Resolve on the same system. We've um, just announced support for Blackmagic's DeckLink um, video output hardware, including the Ultra Studio 4K. So there's there's been a lot of folks that that, that want to be able to use Scratch and Scratch Lab for certain things and Resolve for certain things, but um, until we supported that hardware, there was no way to run them on the same machine. Right. So now they can. Okay, you guys have been busy. Well, we have been busy, yeah. And I think that's great, but there's yeah. another one you wanted to talk about. Well, there's another interesting business-oriented announcement that we made just yesterday. Um, we have partnered with um, several of our technology providers in the industry, uh, as well as with the studio uh, at B&H, to deliver a 4K, no compromise, no excuses, turnkey workstation based on HP Z820 hardware with NVIDIA K6000 graphics, with Fusion I.O. storage, and with video out from either AJA or Bluefish 444, for the same price that yesterday we charged for the 2K version of that system. So overnight, so you bought yesterday, you're, you're, you're a little unhappy right now. No, no. I so, know you'll so take care of everybody. I, but this is, again, this is something that we've been working on for quite a while. And so, so if, you're, if you're interested in this kind of system, we you know, see Michelle at the studio b and because he and I have been working on bringing this system to market for for about six months, and it's, so you know, it's 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 really really exciting. We believe that there's a lot of pent up demand in the studio for right. these 4K workflows, but they were afraid that there was a penalty for doing 4K. It, it's kind of like the way they used to think about stereo. You know, we'll shoot a stereo movie when we can do it for the same price as doing right. non-stereo, right? Right. 4K is kind of the same way. So we want everybody to know that we have basically obliterated the penalty, the Big price rate. penalty for 4K. It's now the same price as 2K. That's exciting. But now for those, we've hit all the bullet points. But you've mentioned Scratch and Scratch Lab, and I'd love for you to go into a little more detail about what they each are. Okay, sure. So um, Scratch Lab is a product that's designed for digital dailies. Uh, it's designed to um, you know, manage the images that come off the camera, do color grading of those images, create looks, and set uh, output a LUT or a CDL and then render the different versions of the dailies that folks need for the, the you know the director, the producer, editorial, VFX. Really, that kind of thing. how important is that? Well, it's crucial. I mean, it's crucial to the success of a production. So something's got you know. The, the interesting thing about this migration to digital cameras over the last several years 
is that now you have to have a way to manage the images. It's, there's no film to take to the lab anymore. Right, right? and no more the lab sends you one uh, tape. Exactly, and, and, and now you you've got all, you know, a myriad of different cameras that all have you know, you know, unique, unique characteristics, unique formats for the data that comes out of those cameras. And so you know, folks like the digital imaging technicians on set um, have all of the knowledge for how to you know, pull the images off, you know, replicate them and duplicate them for the insurance companies, and then you know, create the dailies that go, again, to the stakeholders that want to watch and make sure that they actually got the shot properly. Right. And then you know, the editorial folks downstream that are actually going to cut the story. But you've still got different situations. You've got the DP wants dailies one way, producer wants to always other ways, and this is a system that lets you deliver all that? Well, you know, typically by the time they get to the point where they're shooting the project, they're just, they've decided how they're going to manage the dailies, you know, depending on whether the editors are using Avid or Final Cut Pro or Premiere, determines what format those dailies are going to go out in. Uh, you know, sometimes the director and the, and the DP will decide ahead of time what the look wants to be for the outside shots and the inside shots, so they will have already designed their LUTs ahead of time. But they also have the latitude of, you know, being able to be flexible. So, you know, maybe they're working on a shot that was designed to be shot at noon and they, they got it wrong or something happened and it's now four o'clock in the afternoon when they get around to doing that shot. And so they've got to change the LUT slightly or they want to be able to color grade a little bit right then and there. Or maybe they're working with a green screen and an actor and they want to make sure that they, they light the green screen properly because if it's in, improperly lit, when you go to, to VFX right. at downstream and post, you won't be able to key that image and you know put the background behind that actor properly. So, so they need the flexibility so and the tools to do that. This is what's doing that for you. Exactly. And that's the Scratch Lab. Yeah, exactly. And the other thing is when, when the editor, they're editing it over months, they get used to whatever look there is. So if you don't establish your look in the first place, you have to fight to get it that way. Well, you have that to deal with, and then you have, um, you know, it's very rare to find a production that uses only one camera and productions are using multiple locations, and they're mixing in CG elements with live action elements, and in, in post, you have to basically create this thing so that it looks like it's one story that was told through one eye, you know, and one vision. And that's where our other product, Scratch, comes in, which is the sort of, it's the big brother to Scratch Lab. It's the superset to Scratch Lab. Um, and it's designed to be a, what they call digital intermediate product that does color grading and visual effects and finishing. So it takes all of that footage and it normalizes it, color grades it, and, and, and sort of creates the look that the director had for the vision of that project even before they started. Steve, sounds like fabulous news. Thank you for coming and spending time with us here. Thanks. You're welcome. And Go see Michelle at Studio B&H for that 4K turnkey. And there you have it. And for B&H Photo, I'm Steve from NAB 2014. Thanks for watching.